guys, welcome back, my truckers. Today we're playing another video of Roblox, and we're playing Cabra's Kingdom. So, I totally thought what we should do is dun, 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 do a tour of the whole castle. So, I thought this might be the best thing ever, so you guys know where else to go and everything. So, let's start from the spawning room. Let me just get into the spawning room. Uh, where is the spawning room? Wait, why am I singing the Christmas song? It's not even Christmas yet. Oh, wait, I mean, it finished Christmas. Ah, okay. Starting with the spawning room. This is the spawning room where you will spawn when you come in. KK events. It's a, like an event that they do after some sort of thing. You have to join the that type of thing though here's the farm it's a pretty nice place um you can get tons of different farm towers work in the farm oh okay i came into the event place so let's see here so here we've got the kk events um you have to join the group but um to, for the kk events but let's just get back to the castle because i kind of want to get back to the castle Okay, you guys, we're back in the castle from the spawning room, so that is the KK events. Now, you guys, I am going to take you on a tour outside the spawning room. So, here we go. Here you've all got signs here to make you come to different places, which is pretty nice. Here we got the high rank room where high rank people like these people can totally come in and just have a nice time. Also, relax, it's all pretty cool. Here's a sign saying, please donate. And always here is a weekly newsletter. So you can take this open and you can always look at the weekly newsletter. And sometimes in game, when I go to the toilet in game, I also read this. So yeah, it's a little bit. <laughs> anyway, first, that this way we've got the library. All the books you can ever search for. Book locked. And there we go. Sitting. <clears throat> Place to borrow books, but no one's sitting here right now. All the librarians are in the AFK room. Now, so talking about the AFK room, let me show you the AFK room. This is the AFK room. You'll know it because there's tons of purple arrows pointing everywhere. You might be thinking that the game is empty. Well, if you think that, just come into the AFK room. Do 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 it's crazy how many people are in the AFK room, but yeah. So a lot of the librarians are in the AFK room. Like, see, librarian right now, so that's why I can't. So, um, yes, yeah, so that's why I can't borrow books. But this is the AFK room. So the reason what you do in to sit in the AFK room is you just come and sit down into the AFK room, and you'll see this where my um see when my jump button, and then look at my jump button now. Something comes up by it. And that is where you get the XP. So it says here that <clears throat> my reward is in 3, 2, 1. And then XP per minute is 5 XP. So yeah, and that's how many it's telling me from on top. I need to get 3,000 to get to the next level. And that's the AFK room. So now let's go to the supervisor's room. The supervisor's is if you need to um, ask the supervisor any questions or anything. So that's what you do here papers here is the exit it is just where all your customers come and since i am a receptionist i can totally come in into the back and yeah so take a seat and you can totally so here we go so this is the reception so first of all this is the where i should have started the first video but anyway um here we go so once you get into reception where this white line is the name will come if the person sits in front then if the person is a recruit greet them tell them that you are okay once you um are good and you're allowed to press the green button because they're a recruit you cannot press the green button on non-recruit you might be wondering why well you cannot because if you press it then you will go to jail for 15 minutes because you are not supposed to let people in that already have a job or that are guests they need to join the group and be a recruit so yeah um 
ones I am um, so yeah and I also it's not just for once someone will come and they will tell you next time if you do it if you do it two times then you will go to jail so see here oh and if you do go to jail after you go to jail the customer that is um you will come out of jail and then you will be a visitor so you have to do the trainer thing all over again and that is pretty harsh so do not do that guys i am telling you tell like you anyway let's go so that is why you press green button on only recruits and then you press it and tell them to once you send them to the security room, tell the security to send them to, uh, to send that so themselves to the waiting room. So then tap the green button. If they are not a guest, if they are a guest and or already have a job, then press the red button because you cannot let them through. So that is how the reception works. Now let's move over and here is the diamond collecting. And he can move his head because he is a alien, so he can, for example, turn all the way. Yeah, okay. So, first of all, um, you have invited to zero ranks. So here, this is where you get invited to KK. It's a group, and if you get invited to it by someone else, like, in, so, like, if... In this game, you will get extra um, XP if you invite someone to your game in Converse Kingdom. And so, um... You have to type in what you will type in what what the person's name that invited you to Carver's Kingdom, and then once you submit it, you will be rewarded with some diamonds. So that is how you do it. Here we've got free claim speed boost. Next, I should show you the bathrooms. Here is the male bathroom, which I probably shouldn't be going in, but there it is. And here is the women's bathroom. As you saw in my last video, I pooped behind the toilet. And yeah, it's pretty gross. So anyway, let me just wash my hands. And that's all good. Now, let's go and we're going to go back and I want to show you a very, very clever thing that you can do, which is super duper cool. Um, the Queen at Sunday Assembly after Purple Awards. Now, you guys, I want to show you another way other than um, using um, doing your job to get XP. So if no one's coming to you in reception, this is what you do. You want to find a spill around the castle. Now, it can be a water spill, any type of spill like that spill. And come over to the spill, and then you want to type in chat. Go the semicolon like that. Then you want to say mop, and then do this. Then a mop will appear in your hand, and then you just go, and you can clean that up to get XP. Which is pretty clever, and it's my kind of my favorite way to get XP other than getting people, because a lot of people don't come to me in reception. It's pretty sad. I don't know why. Anyway, now I've got a little bit more XP, and usually you can get like a little cup of water. But our water tank is out, so right now there's exclamation marks and I can't get water. <sighs> Sad. So anyway, let's go with this way and keep it up. You were just um, awarded five XP for five XP for mopping up. Yay! Okay, I'm gonna get so high. Why is the receptionist has an exclamation mark? Are you okay? Are you okay? Okay. Ooh, are you okay? Come back! Come back! Come back! Okay, anyway, here now it's time to show you the upstairs of the awesomeness. <gasps> okay, first of all, this is the upstairs of the awesomeness. So let me go down and I'll show you where. Once you see the sign here, this is the upstairs. The stairs, you're on ground floor right now. So let's go up the stairs into the sky. And get, and then come through, and here is the throne room, which, as you can see, it's locked for our queen. And 
and actually the queen is not actually um playing right now as you can see the queen you might be guessing that the creator of this game is the queen so um yeah that's why if the creator isn't playing the game he created then the queen is not going to be physically moving but there is a statue of her inside of the throne room so yeah and here is the barista wait okay here it is so here you can order bubble teas or shakes and then you can order like hot drinks everything like that but there apparently needs to be a barista over there how is that like how is that librarian being able to okay that's weird anyway here we go and here is the chef's room where you can order food such as a burger sandwiches steak and then for like the desserts is donuts cake pie chalk heart and then for other things it's ramen and pizza so yeah there's a lot of tables for it to be nice some next to the, um thing here's a restaurant so it's pretty nice here that's to go back down. This is to take the another level all the way back up. So it's like this is for another level upstairs. And this is the up, 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 upstairs. Oh, wait, now there's more upstairs? Okay, never mind. <gasps> uh, anyway, so here we go. Here is the meeting room where advisors go. And you can go in with the meeting room. Ow, that hurt me. And here is i think another library and this way is the rankers so this is where rankers come they work and they will get more ranks which is pretty good so then moving on this way is the toilet spawner it's a pass you can get if you need to go toilet really bad in your percentage and you have to quickly spawn a toilet so here we go want to keep working without the hassle of going all the way to the restroom then it, there's a pass for you with a toilet spawner pass you can spawn a toilet from the comfort of your desk so it's a pretty weird crazy pass but anyway yeah it's 250 things but anyway there we go so my toilet percentage right now is 77 percent and i think i should go to the bathroom so let's go down and down one more time and then that should lead us straight to the bathroom and this way is the bathroom so this way is the bathroom uh sometimes i get a little lost okay there it is um so then now let me go and sometimes if you some one time my toilet percentage went all the way down to um 17 and i really had to go and a sign came on top of me and said caution um, emergency go 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 to the toilet or you won't be able to hold that's what it said because once i saw a person um percentage went all the way down and then all of a sudden poop came out at the reception it was crazy so yeah always make sure you go to the toilet and poop falls behind you. Otherwise, the percentage won't go up and you won't be going toilet. <laughs> okay, well, I hope you guys enjoyed this tour. I'll see you in part two where we show you more stuff of this big, amazing castle. Bye, guys. Look at my glimmering face. <laughs>